Hi everyone, I'm Amanda L and today we are doing a short and super strong flow to really wake up your body and build strength. So we are going to dive right in right away, standing at the top of the mat. So coming to the top of the mat, just closing your eyes here for a moment to ground you into this space. Taking a big inhale, arms reach up above your head. Exhale, fold. Right away, stepping back into plank, holding in your plank, maybe rocking a bit back and forth or side to side. Side plank to the left. And side plank to the right. And plank to the center. Lowering all the way down. Pressing right back up. Twice more all the way down. Right back up. Once more all the way down. Up, back, downward dog. Landing here for a moment, pedaling out your feet, swaying your hips a bit side to side. Taking a big inhale, right leg sweeps up and back down, dog split. Maybe bending the knee, opening the hip. Sweeping that foot to the top of the mat, opening up right away, warrior two. Big inhale, lift. Exhale, soften, warrior two. Twice more, just like that, inhale. Exhale. One more big lift, warrior two. This time, inhaling up through center. Bring your heels in, toes out, sinking down. Maybe gentle sway here, just to settle into the space. You can have your arms down at your sides, maybe out wide or up above your head, just wherever you feel called to. Lifting the right heel up off the mat and switching to the left, right, left, keeping your hips sunk low, right, left, right, left, both, toe, or both heels up off the mat, Balancing here, awesome job. Big inhale lifts everything up. Parallel out your feet, forward fold. Walking your hands over towards the right. Sweeping through center to the left. Back through the middle, rounding up to stand. Heels in, toes out, hips sinking once more. From here, we're just going to pulse. So pulsing up and down. Tuning into your breath. Letting it guide you here. If you want a little more of a challenge, you can lift your heels, keeping pulsing there. For five, four, three, two, one, hold. Awesome job. Big inhale, lifting everything up. Parallel out your feet, forward fold. Left palm plants down at the center, opening to the right. Sweeping through the middle to the left. Walk your hands back to the top of the mat, plank. 
holding here. Similar in halfway down, up for one, halfway down, up for two, halfway down, up, back, downward dog. Left leg sweeps up and back, down dog split. Maybe bending the knee, opening the hip. Sweeping that leg forward right away up into a warrior two. Coming into your warrior two. Taking a big inhale. Everything reaches up. Exhale, soften. Twice more, just like that. Big inhale, exhale. One more big lift, softening into your warrior two. Taking another inhale, heels in, toes out. Right back where we just were. This time sinking down into the right side, letting the hips almost graze the mat. Left toes point towards the ceiling. If you need to use your hands as support, it's also a great option. It's pretty cold out here today. It's like 40 degrees right now, so my hands are a little chilly, so I'm gonna hold them and keep them a little warmer. Sweeping through the middle, up and over to the left. Sinking down on the left side. Right toes point up. Taking it through center to the right. Over to the left. You can come up high or you can keep things lower. Just playing around with it, coming from side to side. Moving at your own pace. You can also use your hands as support. Coming to the left side, settling in there. Over to the right. Back up through center, parallel out your feet, forward fold. Hands walk to the top of the mat, stepping back plank. Side plank to the left. Side plank to the right. Planking at the middle. Lowering halfway down, up for one. Halfway down, up, down, up. Twice more, down, up. One more time, down and up. Holding in your plank. Awesome job. Downward dog. Walking your hands back to the back of the mat to meet your feet. Coming into a forward fold of your choice. Maybe clasping the elbows. Maybe your hands interlace back behind your back. Stepping on the palms with the soles of the feet or something else. Settling into a squat. You can stay in your squat if you would like to play a little bit with an arm balance. Finding your crow, bringing your 
knees to the backs of your arms. Looking forward, leaning forward, maybe one toe comes off the mat, maybe both toes, maybe neither. You just work on leaning forward and leaning back to build some strength there. Just making sure you're looking forward. So don't look down. You're going to go where you look. So if you look down, you're going to end up going down. But if you look forward, you will find that balance. Maybe not today, maybe not tomorrow, but you will find it. Coming out of that, coming into a nice seat, soles of the feet together, knees out wide. Taking a big inhale, arms reach back behind you, heart reaches forward. Exhale, fold. As you round up to sit, bring the left leg with you. So cradling it into your arm, kind of like a baby. If this is too much, you can also just bring it out a bit further, holding it with your hands. Rocking it a bit side to side, maybe pulling it forwards and backwards, just really lubricating that hip. Grabbing a hold of the outer edge of the foot with the right hand. Left hand plants back behind you. You can straighten out that leg, coming into a twist. You can also keep the knee bent. Planting the left sole of the foot on the outer edge of the right leg, twisting to the left. Keeping your legs where they're at as you release your twist, stacking your knees on top of each other. Maybe your feet walk out away from your body a bit. You can sit up here or folding over. Rounding up, giving that left leg one more squeeze before letting it go and switching legs. Grabbing a hold of the right leg, giving it a little squeeze, rocking it side to side. Left hand grabs the outer edge of the right foot Coming into a twist towards the right. You can straighten out that leg. Keep it bent. Right sole of the foot to the outer edge of the left leg, twisting to the right. Releasing the twist, stacking your knees, maybe walking your, your shins a little further away from your body as you fold over here.
rounding up, taking that leg with you, giving it one more squeeze. And letting your feet come to the outer edges of your mat, make your way into a wide-legged forward fold. Before folding over though, taking a big inhale, palms back behind you, heart reaches forward. Exhale, folds it forward. You can just plop into this space, or maybe you bring some movement, allowing yourself to walk over to the left, noticing what you feel there. And then eventually making your way over to the right, stopping in any places that feel really good for you. Make your way out of that, coming into a nice, easy seat. Allowing your palms to rest on your thighs and your eyes to float closed. Settling into the stillness of this moment. Big inhale, arms reach up above your head, planting your palms together, bringing your thumbs into your chest, plugging into your heartbeats. Big inhale up through the nose. Long exhale out the mouth. Big inhale. Long exhale. One more super big inhale. One more super long exhale. And opening your eyes whenever you're ready. Thank you so much for joining me today. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below. That would help me out a lot. I would greatly appreciate it. And let me know in the comments if you have any requests for future videos. I would love to hear from you. And with that, I will see you next time.